All right, have a new right hand rule demo for you today. We just did it, so we wanted to get this on the web. I have a large horseshoe magnet. We know that this large part right here is the north, so I'm going to place that on the ground. And then so the magnetic field points from north to south, so we point my hand this direction. Now we have our, uh, we have copper tubes, which are not conductors. There is the, there is the positive on this side. Here is the negative over here on the other side. So the charge is going to go from positive to negative. So the charge is going this direction, magnetic field from north to south, charge is going this way, so it should feel a force into the magnet. We got lucky that these, I'm not sure what they're made out of, but they're not steel because they're not magnetic. Now when I first did this, you'll see that that's been, uh, over time, that that's got what they call a patina, it's, it's corroded or oxidized on the outside. So I took some sandpaper and I cleaned off uh, this side right here, so that, it'll, that it can conduct electricity better. Notice the same side, you can see that's the scratchy side up as it were, a shiny side up. Now I'm going to take the wire, place it across it, inside the magnetic field of the magnet, and turn on the electricity. There you go. Now let's try it by reversing the electricity. should push out of the of the horseshoe magnet. Okay, this is now the positive. You'll see that there's red. We've had some issues with it working sometimes and others. There's just obviously got to be some issue with contact. So let me rough up this surface so that we know we got a good contact here. Make sure I get off all the oxidation. Okay. Do the other one as well. Getting down to good metal. Okay, lay that down. Hopefully, we have good contact. And rough this up just a little bit. Now, right hand rule wise, if that conducts the electricity well, which I hope it will. The current is flowing from positive to negative. I guess I could have a bad contact there as well, but we'll see what happens. Positive and negative. This is the north, this is the south. So, the magnetic field is up. I can rotate that until it's facing. The direction of the current flow should feel a force out. Well, you saw it move. Why it's not moving farther than I'm not exactly sure, but I'll try one more time. Let's come back to your hurry. There we go. 